Yo, 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 what's going on, guys? Fit K in the house, freedom in the kingdom. Thanks for tuning in. Listen, just a quick video. I just want to thank every last subscriber, every person that's commented, every person that sent me five dollars, ten dollars, a dollar on Cash App. I appreciate you. I pray that God bless you ten, one thousand, ten thousand fold, right? For sowing a seed, right? Still haven't figured out things with my, my unit. I just gave it to God. And I said, God, if 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 I lose everything in that unit, I still got you, and that's all that matters. And so um, it says somewhere in the scriptures that wherever your heart is, that is where your tre that's that's what you that is what you you feel that's your treasure. And that's my treasure isn't in that unit, even though there's a lot of collective things that I feel like that can help and that I've saved over the years. Um, I just gotta, I just gotta trust God. And so thank you for 1000. Now it's like 1000, almost 200 subscribers. And like I made this channel May 4th. The first video was May 4th and that's a little over uh, two and a half weeks. I appreciate you guys, man. I, 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 this is encouraging. Not because how fast the channel is growing, but how many people are interested in the information that I have and that it's impacting, right? So I thank you. Um, just for some words of encouragement, y'all. Um, this type of stuff requires crazy, crazy faith, right? I know you guys are thinking that, oh, this guy just popped out of nowhere with this uh, outlandish type of faith and... Like it, it started with baby faith, you know what I mean? Uh, I just want to, I want to really just go over with you what crazy faith is. Crazy faith is thoughts and actions that lack reason, but trusting fully in what you cannot explicitly see. Like I know a lot of you people have been down the rabbit hole with this type of stuff. Some of you people are very new, but. God is doing a new thing, right? God is doing a new thing. He's shifting. There's a transition happening. There's a shifting of wealth. There's a shifting of perception. Like if you're into crypto and Bitcoin like I was uh, a minute ago, um, you know that there was a transition in wealth. Not Now it just wasn't, it just wasn't middle class white brokers that, are, that were, had access to that realm of, of the market. Now it's everybody and young Young people like us who are getting how Bitcoin and how the market and the economy works and taking advantage of the markets and, and cashing in big, right? Um, Hebrews 11 says, now faith is confidence in what we hope for and assurance for what we don't see. Like some of us are, are, are sending our coupons, remittance coupons in and they're these people are not answering and they're, they're throwing it to the side. They're saying, we don't go off federal laws. What are you talking about? We're privately owned. Like conversation I had with the lady uh, from uh, of the electric company in Tampa. She's like, we are privately owned. We don't, we're, we're not off. We're not under figure. Uh, we're not under a statutory uh, of the uniform commercial code, which is, she's been grossly misled because she is. But um, you gotta understand that this is not all in vain. This is not something I chose and and, and woke up one morning. And I was like, yeah, I'm a, I'm I'm gonna start studying contract law and 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 U C C codes and United States codes. And I'm I did not wake up one morning and, and, and this information was brought into my life and given to me and presented to me. And God was like, it's either you run with this or you keep going away that you we're going before and the way I was going before just it just wasn't it just wasn't working it's like throwing spaghetti at the wall and they expected it to stick right um look guys um some of us are just worried about too many things at one time right we're just worried about if this is going to work or if if you're doing your due diligence and you have true faith in a creator that can make things that are impossible happen right um what was that? Oh, that's my phone. Listen, this stuff is 
this stuff is real life laws. This is real life history of, of how the world has been running, yo. And cool, I can probably give you all the information I got in my folder, my 1099A folder that I got labeled on my, on my computer, and you just take it and do what with it? You don't know any history behind it. You don't know uh, any any type of content behind it, and you don't understand really what is what you're doing. You still need instruction. It says to, to win a war, because this is a war, not against physical people, but these are against demonic spirits and high principalities, right? And if you have no understanding who you are and what this information is, then you're just going to be a person that's asking for a hand out and not a hand up. When we don't want to ask for handouts, we want a hand up, right? We need a hand up so we can keep moving, right? Some of you guys thinking that the way God works is is the way is is based on your traumatic experiences from your parents or some of your parents were just uh, just very interesting or your guardians are very interesting. And you think this is how God works. So um, some of some people on here, you'll notice in the comments or hop on here and just giving their opinions about how stuff is how stuff how they're going to how they see stuff happening in the few how they foresee it in the future when they're not even most of them are not even doing any of the stuff that we're doing they're not doing their due diligence they're not looking into these laws they're not sending coupons or remittance coupons out to companies and writing letters to companies they're just here to speculate and to take away from what you're doing right don't be distracted um First John, I think, or it says John 10, 10 says the enemy only kills or the thief comes to kill, steal, destroy. He wants to kill your amb your ambition and your, and your faith. He wants to steal your joy and he wants to, he, he wants to he wants to dead you. He wants you to work until you until you rot and 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 do frivolous things to, to burn and waste your energy out i rather live life on the edge right now like i'm living my pat my bill listen my bills are past past due past past due but i know god is going to take care of me and he's got so many promises that's that promise that says that if i declare and decree something and i believe it he said if i if i tell this mountain to, to jump into the ocean and i believe with no doubt in my mind that that, that mountain's got to move and jump into the ocean if i believe it right so how much more for some tax laws and contract laws that are 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 very very valid to come into play right god is doing a new thing you can look at as many um cases as you want versus cases as you want and try to try to you know Try to get an understanding of, of how your the income the the outcome of it is, is going to be based on past situations. But guys, look, this is not going to be the same. People didn't are, are, haven't gone to jail and prison for this type of stuff. You're going to see people who are in, in high positions and people that are running companies get thrown into prison and jail for this type of stuff that they're evading tax fraud, mail fraud. They're 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 doing trust fraud. They're they're taking literally do you understand that these same bills or these coupons that they're sending you is your look up the word um slipped my mind now jesus coupon bearer i think that's what it's called give me one second what is it i have so many things is be so many definitions, bro. But listen, God is giving me the uh, bond bearer. Words like coupon bonds, a negotiable instrument payable to its holder, right? There's more to this definition. I need you guys to look up these types of things. Bond bearer, coupon bearer, right? Instrument, coupon bonds, coupon, worthless securities, billing statement. You need to look up these things. Essentially, these bills and these coupons, they're sending you interest that's come that's that's from a bill that's already been paid by your trust and they're actually sending you what they're going to get back at the end of the year when they file this 1099a on your behalf because a 1099 is an abandonment and acquisition of property so they're claiming that you're not claiming your they're you're not claiming your credits for these bills that you're paying or that already prepaid for you and they're, they're claiming it for themselves and double dipping, which is trust fraud, right? So really those bills are statements or a coupon for you to get that exact 
amount back. Your bill's three hundred eighty dollars for for uh, uh, a utility bill or a coupon or or a credit card bill. That is supposed to be yours. You're supposed to be able to claim that credit at the end of the year with a ten ninety nine a. I can go more into this stuff, but I don't want to make. I always say don't want to make this video long, and then it's always twenty minutes long. So my fault, my fault, guys. I, let me put that pad down. Listen. Um, listen, the, the point is, guys, that it's impossible to please God without faith. And you, if you believe in a relationship with the Most High, with Jah, Jehovah, El Shaddai, with Hosanna, yes, you are. You understand? Then you, you must understand that this, this is not just about monetary gain. This is not about monetary gain. That's just, that's just the fruits of it. Okay. Th this is about for a lot of us testing our faith, right? Testing our faith. You believe, some people believe that this is going to work for you, but you won't pray to God about the common cold or something that you're dealing with that's small. You got to start off with small things, exercising your faith, and then you can have big faith where you're just like doing things that people like, yo, you mentally insane, bro. Like, you don't think you got to pay bills, my guy? You don't think you, you got to, you, you got to pay bills like everyone else. You're going to run into people. You got to pay bills just like everybody else. They're brainwashed, yo. They don't know who they are. Again, man. Listen, I got new information. If you're into the 1099A stuff, awesome. I haven't really gotten into that part of, I'm into that part in my journey, but I don't want to overwhelm you with, with things. If you're into that type of stuff already, I got it. You understand? But I'm on the coupons right now. The utilities part of, of, of getting um, discharging debt is, is a, an area of resistance and um, as, as many times as I have talked to CEOs and sent remittance coupons and things of that nature, right? You guys are like, oh man, it's been two weeks. Where's the coupon at, man? Listen, <laughs> you're not doing the, you're not doing anything. People who say and ask questions like that aren't doing this stuff. They're just looking for a handout. They're looking for a handout. They're looking for a magic code or a magic letter to send to their, all their bills. You'd be like, ta-da, all your bills are paid. It don't work like that. This come with a price like everything else. So like this ain't gonna be for everybody. If you shaky and you scared and you gotta see proof what everybody else doing and you ain't doing nothing, just delete, just just get off the get off my channel. There's so many other channels that you can that you can utilize that'll just, you know, you know. Reform you right back into the world and its, and its interesting views and perceptions and slave-like practices, but this is not the channel for that. I'm I'm trying to tell you. Um, so with that, guys, I appreciate everything everybody's done for for this channel. Um, if you feel like I add value to your life, my Cash App is Moto V M O T O V Cash App. I'm all wearing all green. I got locks. Um, I'm wearing shirts for the rest of my, my videos, guys. I've, I've had people say they, that this, it's a distraction. I just naturally, I don't wear a shirt. I just sweat. See, look, I'm sweating now. I'm sweating now. I just naturally don't wear a shirt. But for the sake of this, this is this is for the people. And I want you to concentrate on what I'm saying and not what I am what I got on and what's going on with my body. I want you to, I want you to focus. Because this is your life. This is your livelihood. Imagine getting this. And, and enjoying the fruits of it and be able to pass this on to your kids. Alright? Peace and love, guys. Stay focused. My email, M-R-E-I-D at Rocket, the number one, M-R-E, M-R-E-I-D, the number one, at Rocketmail.com. My next video is going to be some content of uh, what's going on in my life. And uh, <laughs> I'm just trying to be authentic as possible. When God tells me to release some information to you, I'll release it to you. But um, other than that, man, peace and love. Appreciate your, appreciate your time and support.